following a big story out of Spartanburg County, where Republican Josh Kimbrell unseated longtime Senator Glenn Reese in District 11. Our Kimberly Brown caught up with Kimbrell to talk about his campaign and this big win. The change in the District 11 Senate seat is the end of an era for Spartanburg, but it's also the beginning of something new. After nearly 30 years of serving as the Democratic State Senator in Columbia, Glenn Reese will no longer represent the people of Spartanburg. I would say to him, thanks for your service and thanks for a spirited campaign. Republican challenger Josh Kimbrell defeated the incumbent in Tuesday's election. Early on we felt pretty good with some of the early tabulations on the door at the various polls, but the official results we didn't get until darn near 3 a.m. District 11 covers Spartanburg County, Boiling Springs, Chesney, and Inman. For the Kimbrough campaign, reaching non-traditional voters was important. We were very happy to see that in my race last night, we did very well with Latino voters. We increased a, the percentage of African-American voters that voted for a Republican Senate candidate. Campaign workers made phone calls, knocked on doors, and even mailed flyers. Both Reese and Kimbrell acknowledged that straight party voting helped Republican candidates. We think there's some effect to that, okay? I mean, certainly the president has strong coattails here. Kimbrell ran on the platform of economic development, lower taxes, protecting life, and defending the Second Amendment, topics that taxpayers voted to support. I, mean, I want to build a coalition of all of us building a community that works for everybody together. Kimbrell holding his first seat in the State House will be sworn in in January of 2021. Reporting from Spartanburg, Kimberly Brown, News.